What's happening, Night Riders? So, we are back for more Ruby. This is Volume 5, Chapter 11. The more, the merrier. Now... Okay. We pretty much left off with Blake's family surviving the little onslaught. Um, her friend finally switched sides and was like, she's going to help out Blake. Uh, seems as though that they're going to be teaming up against Roman and the rest of the Faunus. I mean, not Roman, uh, uh, Adam. I don't know why I keep mixing their names up, but Adam. So, I know that this episode, this chapter kind of, like, messed with a lot of people. So, I'm a little nervous going into this, but we're just going to jump straight into this, y'all. Chapter 11, Volume 5. Let's go. Oh yeah, and this is whole setup to take out Crow. Take out Crow and Ruby and the rest of them. I don't know what it is about the Ruby intros, but like, they all are catchy as fuck. <laughs> and then they grow on you, even if you don't like it in the beginning. I think that's the first time we ever seen the moon look like that. I only ever remember seeing like half of it missing, never like it as a whole, you know what I mean? Again, we're still not going to talk about Ruby Silver Eyes. Like, I really want to know. I really want to know true power behind her eyes. Why, hello. Aw, oh, shit. Thank you for uh, coming. There seems to be more of you than last time. Hey, you know what they say. I'm surprised you Oscar went. So what's going on with the council? Why did you bring your weapons? What? Leo, we're huntsmen. <laughs> you okay? Of course. Of course. Sorry. Just haven't had my evening coffee. Look, it's nice to see you, but uh, we Ooh, got work to do. Oh, she sees Are the we raven. Getting support from the council or not? Mom? <laughs> oh, shit. Yo, shit popped off quick. Raven, they, they really are magic. If you're going to shoot me, shoot me. That was insulting. What mm. are you doing here? She kept I it a buck. Ask you the same thing. The hell? You've been scheming, little brother. Planning to attack your own sister. Leo. What have you done? I... Leo did what any sane person would in his position. He looked at all the information he had in front of him, assessed the situation, and made a choice. Damn. And it seems you all have, too. 
You have the Spring Maiden. I do. Then hand her over and let's work together. We can beat Salem. All that time spent spying for Ozpin and you still have no idea what you're dealing with. There is no beating Salem. You're wrong. We've done things that most people would call impossible. And I know the only reason we were able to do it is because we didn't do it alone. We had people to teach us. People to help us. Fast. We had each other. Work with us. At least I know we'll have a better chance if we try together. Please. You sound just like your mother. Ah! Oh! Ruby! Hello, boys and girls. Oh, shit! Fuck, they got two maidens on their side, though. Come on, guys. Is that any way to greet your old friends? Everybody stay calm. Oh, no. Get the, the fuck out. The white thing is out. demolition and securing the school grounds. No one's getting in. And no one is getting out. Once the charges are set, move back to Perimeter Watch. Tonight, Haven Falls. This was all just a trap? It appears so. Raven, tell me, how long have you been with them? Aw, don't take it personally, little bird. Your sister was a recent addition. The lion, on the other hand. Entrance into the Vital Festival was a real treat. But Leonardo's been sending Salem all sorts of information for a very, very long time. Mm. Isn't that right, Professor? Stop it. It was you. You sit on the Mistral Council. You had information on every huntsman and huntress in the kingdom. Oh, you gave it all to her. I... I couldn't find any of them. Because you let her kill them. Oh, now, don't beat yourself Damn. up about it, Lionheart. I'm sure Tyrion and Hazel would have found them on their own eventually. What is wrong with you? How can you be so broken in size? To take so many lives? And then come here and rub it in our faces like it's something to be proud of. John. Oh, with that damn smile on your face. Everybody stay calm. I'm going to make you pay for what you did. Do you hear me? Kid. Well, say Yo. something. Yo. Who are you again? That's fucked up. Very well, then. 
Fuck. I can't. Young man, I don't know who you are or what you think you're doing, but for your sake, I suggest you leave. Now. Kill when he find out that's Osborne. That was actually kind of cool. That was actually kind of cool. Get him, Oscar. This can't be. I knew you would be back, but you made it here. You found Crow. How? Leo, what happened to you? Wait. You can't have had this form for long. You're not really ours, Pit, right now. Boy. Child. I deliver you to save them. She'll have to be pleased with me. And I can oh. finally get out of all of this. I can finally be free. What do I do? Fight? Pharaoh. Kill, that's sick. Failure with a death wish. 
If I die buying them time, then it's worth it. They're the ones that matter. You think so? It, it it hit her side. She's gonna live. She's how you in the fuck it? How you? In no, no. I need a minute. Fuck out my way. Move. How you end the episode like that? Like, what the fuck? Okay. It wasn't directly in the center. It's it. It, it was her side. Like, let me show you. It was it was here. So like, she can survive that. She's she's gonna be out of a fight right now, but she can survive it. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Yo. The fact that Ruby's Ruby started to use her power and she wasn't able to use the full effect because Emerald knocked her out, but it made her think of Pera when she was going after Jean. So I guess it put her in that same type of mental state of losing a friend. But like, see, I don't know if her silver eyes are a weakness just to the fall maiden, or if the silver eyes are a weakness to the maidens, or like, if, it, if she subconsciously using the silver eyes just to target cinder like I, I i don't know this is why i want them to explain the silver eye so badly um i'm not sure how they're gonna get out of this i'm not sure like i know i know that blake is on the way but if i remember correctly didn't they decide to attack earlier so, I don't know. And then you got the charges that's outside that, that'll make the building blow. Yo, things are not looking good. Like, at all. At fucking all. <sighs> that was chapter 11 I think you guys told me that there are 14 chapters in this volume which means that we got three chapters left I don't know I re I really don't know y'all because that shit just fucked my head up that shit fucked my head. I'm not right. Post your comments down below. <sighs> Let me know what you thought about chapter 11 of volume 5. 
entitled The More The Merrier. I cannot believe that she fucking stabbed Weiss. It, it wasn't a fatal blow, but it was a blow to where it's that that's going to do serious damage. Or put it this way, it, it's a blow to take her out of a fight. Part of me feels like Ruby's going to wake up and see Weiss hurt and spaz. Like she's going to completely flip the fuck out. I don't know. I don't fucking know. They like they are at such an unbelievable disadvantage. It's really not even funny. Because the only huntsman or the only one that's fully trained is Crow and he's dealing with his fully trained sister. Um Ruby Weiss, Yang, Ren, Nora uh Jean like they're not fully trained and they're going up against fully trained bad guys then you got the fall maiden and you got the spring maiden that's on the same team as the bad guys like this uh, th yo the whole situation is just looking so fucking dire and it's making me nervous for the next episode so I'm gonna end this video because I'm rambling because I'm in shock and I, I, I don't know I don't know so again now writers post your comments down below let me know what you thought about this chapter hopefully you enjoyed this reaction and hopefully they make it out some way somehow <sighs> till next time y'all Ride or die, Night Riders. We out.